Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to talk a little bit about how long it took me to get to my first thousand subscribers. So I've got my coffee ready and we're gonna head up and have a little look at my computer and see how long exactly it took me to get a thousand subscribers on YouTube because I actually have had this question asked a lot, uh, especially on my other channel. And I haven't really come up with an answer for anyone yet. So I thought I'd give you guys a little bit more of an insight, I guess, in how long it could take to get a thousand subscribers. However, having said all this, everyone is on a different path with YouTube as far as I'm concerned. So you guys might get there quicker than me. In fact, I'm sure there's like a lot of people out there that could get there quickly to get to a thousand subscribers. But look, everyone is on their own path with it and it takes people different amounts of time to actually get there. So we're gonna go through today the dates of how long it actually took me to get there. And hopefully we're going to give you some really good insight on how long it might actually take. And I just had to show you this. Before we start, how cute is she? Hey, you wanna find out how long it took? <laughs> Okay, so I just want everyone to know that I started my channel probably about seven years ago now. So it has been a pretty long time since I first started uh, posting videos and getting subscribers onto YouTube, but I started in 2014. It was late 2014. I started posting a couple of tutorial videos on my YouTube channel. So just to let you guys know though, when I started posting these videos, uh, I wasn't very consistent at the start. So I started probably like early August. Uh, I think it was about the 1st of August I posted my first video on YouTube. And then from that point onwards, it took me until probably about May the following year in 2015 when I actually started to become very consistent with YouTube. So keep that in mind when I actually share with you guys how long it took me to get to a thousand subscribers and um, maybe that will come into effect when you're thinking about, well, how can I get subscribers maybe a little bit more quickly or how can I post content a little bit more consistently too. So let's get into it without further ado and we'll find out how long it took me to get a thousand subscribers on YouTube. So let's get into it. I am currently looking at my YouTube analytics at the moment and I have selected some dates here. I've had to actually go back through and find out the exact date that it took to actually get to a thousand subscribers because I really couldn't remember and I know that the video that I posted when I did get a thousand subscribers was a little bit delayed so let's have a look here as I said I posted my first YouTube video on the 1st of August 2014 so that was my when my first tutorial went up and then I posted a couple of videos as you can see here on my timeline a couple of videos here and there over the coming months and a little bit in January, but really not much in between. So like I said before, I was not consistent. I was not very consistent in that first year. Uh, I was doing a lot of uh, search friendly content though. So I guess that helped with getting a few more views and for people finding my channel as well. It kind of got into April and May when I started doing a lot more videos. And you can see here that I started becoming very consistent. And it actually took me until the 1st of July, 2015 to get a thousand subscribers. So that was actually less than a year. It was only 11 months in total exactly, <laughs> pretty much to the date. And that's how long it took me to get a thousand subscribers. So as you can see, I probably could have gotten them maybe a lot quicker if I had been more consistent between the 1st of August when I posted my first few videos and then say the end of the year or just into 2015, I could have had that a lot quicker. But because of my poor consistency at the time, and to be fair, I didn't really know what I was doing with YouTube at that stage. I didn't know that I had to be consistent to sort of get consistent on regular views and, and things like that. And that was how YouTube worked. Um, I didn't really know that so in hindsight this is all very easy to say but as I said really the bulk of my subscribers were coming through around uh, the time that I started being very consistent which was in May and then the end of July then so really over those few months that's when I got the bulk of that thousand subscribers coming through. So yeah, as I said, if you're thinking about starting a YouTube channel and you're not thinking too much about consistency at this stage, it is definitely something to keep in mind if you were looking at long-term earning money off of YouTube or if you're looking at you know, really building a brand on YouTube or using it to market your business. It's something to keep in mind, especially in your first couple of years because consistency is really gonna matter. Okay guys, well, I really hope that you've enjoyed this video and if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel already, make sure you do because I'll be posting a lot more content like this on my channel very soon and a lot more YouTube related content as well. So please let me know if you do have any requests and I'd be happy to try and fulfill them. But thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye. And Suki says bye as well.